Hi there, so today I'm going to be talking all about outfitting for your little one for their first birthday to celebrate that big milestone. It's such an exciting time when a little one reaches their first birthday, often they're walking at around that time which is lovely as well. Lots of big milestones but the first birthday really is such a special one. So I've picked out some beautiful outfits depending on the weather of course. Um, that's something we really need to be mindful of when we are dressing little ones throughout the year but particularly for this special day we want them looking lovely but also something that's really comfortable and practical. So I've chosen some items for summer first up which I'll talk to you about. So I've got this gorgeous little romper as an option on a really hot day and of course matching back with a gorgeous hat um, and of course you could put a little t-shirt or something underneath if you wanted to just for a bit more sun coverage depending on where you're going and of course we can always add things like cardigans so I've got this gorgeous little cardigan here with the ruffles at the bottom that you could add if you wanted to if the, the weather did change. I've also got this gorgeous other little romper outfit here with a little um, headband that's a great option as well. Um, easy access to the nappy of course, something that's just really sweet and lovely and very practical and comfortable. So it really does depend on what you'd like to choose. Of course you can't go past the dress <laughs> for a baby's first birthday. Um, and again I've got the headband to match here which is lovely and this is a beautiful ruffle dress and again of course to complete the outfit or to keep them warm on a cooler day you could of course add a cardigan. So that's a lovely option as well. And then I've also picked out this gorgeous little um, outfit here and again this one's just gorgeous because it's really practical and functional. Some little ones really like to choose um, to wear outfits that are more of a, a romper style or a little um, a, a suit style like a full body um, item rather than a dress um, and depending on what you're doing on the day as well this can be a lovely option and easy dressing at the back as well which is great. I've also chosen another dress because I think can't go past dresses. This one's just stunning. It's got a zip at the back which is lovely, a beautiful um, lightweight muslin. This would be great for summertime but also trans-seasonally of course again you could add a long sleeve top underneath if you chose on, on a day where it's a bit chilly and then you could complete the outfit again with a cardigan, either the pink um, or more of a neutral tone if you like that. It's really up to you but there's so many options. Then moving into those trans-seasonal periods, of course, I've um, thought of that as well. So I've got this gorgeous long sleeve full bloom dress, which is absolutely gorgeous. And of course, with any dresses um, trans-seasonally, it's always a good idea to add tights if you feel. Um, and of course, adding a beanie if you need to. And again, adding those layering pieces like a cardigan or a little jacket or something like that can be lovely. If they are walking you might want to think about some shoes as well. So there's some things to think about there. And of course you can't go past a pinafore and I've got a gorgeous little headband again to match that and I've put a little long sleeved bodysuit underneath. Um, and again it might look lovely with some tights and of course again matching with a gorgeous little um, strawberry cardigan too can be a lovely idea. If you like a more um, an item that you can I guess wear more trans-seasonally and again be great for um, dressing on other days rather than just for birthdays. Something like a gorgeous little penny like this in a chambray can be lovely because again you can match it back with so many other items so this could be a great choice as well. Now moving on to boys, um, for summertime you might want to think about shorts and a t-shirt. I know that might sound quite simple but you can obviously dress it up by putting a shirt with it if you like to. Um, we've got our lovely long sleeve shirt that's all year round as part of our um, everyday essentials which is great. Um, but if it is a hotter day you could choose a short sleeve shirt or like we said a t-shirt um, and then you can of course add a hat if you feel you need to as well. And then of course you can't go past our little gorgeous overall with a short leg during the summertime and again this can be one on its own with a matching hat or you could again layer with a t-shirt underneath either a blue which is lovely or you could of course add something really um, just really neutral that's going to go back with lots of other things so this one's gorgeous as well. Um, there's also a few other little overalls here that I've chosen out again because there's so many great options and these both have matching hats and again you could definitely put a little t-shirt under any one of these either just something really neutral or something that matches back beautifully with a colour underneath and again matching um, hats and things like that is something you want to think about there. Um, you could of course think about a nice little pant, this one's gorgeous and again I think this would look lovely with our shirt here, a long sleeved shirt um, and of course you could put a hat back with it. Um, for those more trans-seasonal periods or winter and that sort of thing I think this outfit here is perfect with our lovely little chino pant. 
in the blue or you could choose a bone color there's so many options when it comes to putting back putting a shirt with a pair of pants or again with a short um, there's just so many different options there now if it did turn cold you could think about doing a jumper um, and this gorgeous little pant again you could choose a bone pant if you like but a jumper is always a lovely option um, to complete a boy's outfit for those winter months as well or you could even put it over the top of the shirt um, with the pant um, so really there are so many options when you're thinking about dressing a little one for this really exciting milestone their first birthday so I hope this has helped with um, deciding what types of things you might like to put together to create a beautiful outfit for your little one's first birthday thank you so much